This is what needs to happen on climate change, the world needs to put a price on carbon emissions and let the market respond. If politicians pretend this can be done without pain, it will probably result in another 5 to 10 years of pretending to take action. Akimbo, this must be one of the odder looking words in the language and puzzles us in part because it doesn't seem to have any relatives. What's more, it is now virtually a fossil word, until recently almost invariably found in arms akimbo, a posture in which a person stands with hands on hips and elbows sharply bent outward, one signaling impatience, hostility, or contempt. Many papers you write in college will require you to include quotes from one or more sources. Even if you don't have to do it, integrating a few quotes into your writing can add life and persuasiveness to your arguments. The key is to use quotes to support a point you're trying to make rather than just include them to fill space.
The climate for doing business improved in Egypt more than in any other country last year, according to a global study that revealed a wave of company-oriented reforms across the Middle East. The World Bank rankings, which look at business regulations, also showed that the pace of business reforms in Eastern Europe was overtaking East Asia. The majority of early pictures in the gallery's care are by unknown artists, and fundamental question, such as when, where, and why they were painted still remain to be answered. Through the application of scientific methods, this has potential to unlock key that will allow us to determine answers to these questions. The elephant is the largest living land mammal. During evolution, its skeleton has greatly altered from the usual mammal, designed for two main reasons. One is to cope with the great weight of huge grinding cheek teeth and elongated tusk, making the skull particularly massive. The other is to support the enormous bulk of such a huge body.
A study of nearly 2,000 children found that those who reported playing video games for three hours per day or more performed better on cognitive skills tests involving impulse control and working memory compared to children who had never played video games. To some extent, attendance at cultural venues and events is influenced by a person's age and the composition of the household in which they live. For example, those people in households with dependent children were more likely to visit zoological parks and aquariums than people living in single-person households. The tortoise size and shell shape varies depending on where they live. The shell is made of bone and is a dull brown color. Their ribs, backbone and breastbone have become part of the shell, which is why you can never separate the tortoise from its shell. The most important issue is concerned with the problem of funding. 
social services receive different donations or grants from the government. However, these sums are not sufficient for the solution of all problems. The second most important issue consists in the huge spending. The money social services achieve is not enough for normal functioning. The third problem affecting human services is the lack of skilled and experienced employees. The researchers think that long-distance flyers such as the American golden plover and the white-rumped sandpiper picked up the spores, while lining their nests. Then when the birds arrive in new places they molt, leaving behind the feathers and their precious cargo to start growing again at the other end of the world. Our information office on campus provided resource and support to help you make the right choices about childcare whether you're a student, staff, or member of the local community. The office provides information about the five centers closest to our campuses, relevant government agency, and other daycare center in the surrounding areas.
If bonus or incentive pay schemes work so well for chief executive and bankers, why does everyone not get them? After all, many jobs involve making important decisions or taking risks. Is there anything about corporate decision and financial risks that makes these categories of work special in terms of how they need to be incentivized and rewarded? In the Middle Ages, the design and use of flags were considered a means of identifying social status. Flags were, therefore, the symbols not of nations, but of the nobility. The design of each flag resembled the devices on the noble's coat of arms, and the size of the flag was an indication of how high the owner stood in the nobility. The assembly also decided that, at that special session, it would adopt a concise and action-oriented political declaration, agreed upon in advance by consensus through intergovernmental negotiations under the auspices of the conference.
The wonderful framework of mature trees creates a secluded in plants atmosphere that unites a great variety of plantings to inspire visitors in all seasons. Spring in the garden is marked by flipping up and flowering of trees and the eruption of the flowers in the pulp of needle and woodland understory. Legal writing is usually less discursive than writing in other humanities subjects, and precision is more important than variety. Sentence structure should not be too complex. It is usually unnecessary to make extensive use of adjectives or adverbs, and consistency of terms is often required. Orientalists, like many other 19th century thinkers, conceive of humanity either in large collective terms or in abstract generalities. Orientalists are neither interested in nor capable of discussing individuals, instead, artificial entities predominate. Similarly, the age old distinction between Europe and Asia, or Occident and Orient, herds beneath very wide labels every possible variety of human plurality reducing it in the process to one or two terminal collective realities.
Before the discovery of Australia, people in the Old World were convinced that all swans were white, an unassailable belief as it seemed completely confirmed by empirical evidence. The sighting of the first black swan might have been an interesting surprise for a few scientists, but that is not where the significance of the story lies. Companies will want to be known not just for the financial results they generate, but equally for the imprint they leave on society as a whole. First, ensuring that their products contribute positively. Second, operating in a way that approaches a net neutral impact to the natural environment. And third, cherishing their people. 